What does Reset All Settings do on Android? If you're wondering what happens when you reset all settings on your Android device, you're in the right place. Let's break it down step by step. When you decide to reset all settings on your Android phone, you're essentially restoring the settings to their default state, just like when you first got the phone. Here's what this process does. First, it resets all the system settings, such as your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and mobile network configurations. This means any custom settings you've made to these features will be gone, and they'll revert back to how they were when you first set up your phone. To do this, you typically go into your phone settings, scroll down to the connection and sharing or a similar section, and then find the option to reset settings. You might need to enter your phone's password to confirm the action. Once you confirm, the reset process will start and your phone will revert all the system settings to their default values. This includes any customized settings for things like display, sound, and notifications. However, it's important to note that resetting all settings does not erase your personal data, apps, or files. Your photos, contacts, and downloaded apps will remain intact. This is different from a factory reset, which wipes everything off the phone, including all data and apps. Resetting all settings can be useful if you're experiencing issues with your phone's performance or if you've made some settings changes that you can't seem to undo. It gives you a fresh start with your settings without losing any of your important data. So if you're looking to reset your phone's settings to their default state without losing your personal data, resetting all settings is the way to go. Just remember to back up any important settings or configurations you might need later, even though your data and apps will be safe.